The movie is brilliant, man. You know, a huge undertaking, perfectly executed by the artist, written and directed by Melanie Martinez. It's called K through 12. It's a perfect partner to the album of the same name, which is streaming now on Apple Music. K through 12 is like your first major journey that you become aware of. Yep. Ultimately, when you start making decisions for yourself, it's at K. Yep. And Wheels on the Bus is kind of where that all begins. Wheels on the Bus feels definitely the most kindergarten to me. Yeah. Um, and it is the start, you know, uh, going on the bus and having that whole experience meeting people on the bus, either getting bullied on the bus or... You were bullied? You were, you were a victim of that? Yeah, definitely. Big time. Oh, I was bullied for like my teeth, for how I dressed. You know, if I wore makeup, they would be like, oh, you look like a clown, you know, like just little things that like that. And I was very sensitive too. So I think that me being extra sensitive, just like I... There is no point in anyone's life where being called a clown is fun. <laughs> no. Did you always have a strong personality? Um, no, I was very introverted. I was kind of eccentric, but also very sensitive. So like I would get my feelings hurt easily when I was a kid, but I was also very, I guess I was just, I was always like outdoors and always like climbing things, jumping off things. I was just all over the place. Yeah. So nature was, is a language that, that you understood? Definitely. Yeah, that's like my, you know, uh, safe place being out in the backyard and just like hearing the birds chirping and just like looking at like the trees blowing in the wind. Like that's my favorite. It makes perfect sense because if we're talking about K through 12 right here, the movie, which of course accompanies the album and they're not separate, they're together. Um, you know, nature is, is, is plays a big part in this film. You, you filmed it in Budapest? Yeah. How was that? Um, it was very intense. Why uh, Budapest? The locations it would have been so expensive to try to build out all of those like Rococo, like Baroque style sets. Um, mm. So it was just perfect to like go and actually like location scout and see all these beautiful palaces that are just uh, mind blowing. How sure. long did you spend out there before you even started filming? Oh, it was a month of pre production in LA and a month of pre production in Budapest. And then we shot, it was a 31 day shoot in Budapest. Wow. Yeah. So tell me about the making of this record, because I was just saying one of the things I love about it is just like how complicated and yet simplistic the production is. There's so much going on, yet you retain these nursery rhyme type feels to the songs. Yeah. Um, well, we started, me and Mikey, Mikey Keenan produced it, Michael Keenan, and we started in 2015 after I put out Cry Baby, mm -hmm. and we would just, you know, at first when I decided to make the whole overall theme school, I had to just write down a bunch of titles because that's the way that my brain works. Like, I like thinking about the theme first, and then I'd go in the studio with Mikey, and we would go through all these sounds and um, really just any sound that would come up that would remind me of a title that I had written down, I would, and it was in that moment, I'd be like, okay, I'm going to go with this title because we just found this sound and it makes sense and it feels like it's time to work on this. So, so you know, like Class Fight, for example, is like the, probably the one song on the album that this happened with because um, I never really go back. I always like just, I write it then, I record it then, and I never touch it. So with Class Fight, it was the f only song that I actually went back and I redid the whole chorus um, because I just didn't think it was strong enough uh, lyrically and also melodically. And mm -hmm. so I was just like, I'm going to redo this. And I was so happy that I did that because it's like one of my favorite like songs to dance to. Yeah, there's the so much yeah. movement going on. It's totally. great. What was the hardest song for you to wrangle to get um, into shape? I think the hardest song, I would say classified because I had to go back to it. The other ones came pretty intuitively. Like the easiest song was like Nurse's Office just happened and that was it.